Hello and welcome to a new Animal Crossing video! If you're new to my channel, my name is Michana and I provide you with Animal Crossing content as well as Hoko Life and any other cozy Nintendo gaming related stuff, so if you're into that, feel free to subscribe, it would mean the world to me. When it comes to Animal Crossing, I upload build videos of my new island Red Shift, which is a desert meets city core island as well as island tours of your island, so if you're interested in seeing your island in one of my videos, I actually have a submission form, so the link will be in the video's description, so if you would like to see your island, make sure to fill it in so I can showcase your gorgeous island. I also create my own custom designs in Animal Crossing, so basically like designs for fake buildings, especially shops, which are based on NPC characters, so if you're interested in getting the creator codes of these, I will always make sure to display them in my videos and you can also find them in the video's description. But you can also follow me on my social medias if you would like to, because any support helps me grow and just keeps me motivated, so all my socials will be linked in the video's description as well. So if you would like to keep in touch with me, feel free to do so, I love making new Animal Crossing friends. So you might have spotted today's build in the distance already, so what we are going to do within this video is build a hotel which is based on Red, who is also the inspiration for this island called Red Chipped. As I said, it's basically a desert core and city core island. So my goal with this island is like to have a city core part, which is like near the entrance with a shopping district and just anything related to cities, for example, shops and restaurants, cafes, and also a hotel, which is right here. So this is today's plan. But I also try to keep the desert aesthetic, so within my next videos I will also make a lot of Egypt inspired builds using pyramids and stuff, so stay tuned for all the different ways and kind of designs and builds I'm going to share within this island. So yeah, as I said, today's video will be dedicated to this hotel build, which you can see in the distance. And as I said, it's based on red and also a design made by myself, which I called Red Residences Hotel. To be honest, now that I'm looking at it, I could have also made a pun and called it Red Residences Hotel, which would kind of sound like pretty cool. But I didn't come up with this idea um, until I finished it and then I was like, Hold on a second, I could have given it such a cool and catchy name and I was like, oh my god, I absolutely didn't see this opportunity at all because I chose Red Residences as name because I wanted to have like a perfect flow, like two words which start with a R, but I didn't think of combining those two words, so I called it Red Residences Hotel. In other news, this design is highly inspired by this build, which I am going to display right now. Um, I actually forgot the username of this creator, but I will make sure to look it up in the meanwhile and also display it right here. So this is basically the inspiration behind this build and I was absolutely in love with the way the items were arranged and also the dimension of this build, so also adding all those items which make it look like a realistic building, so I try to recreate that in my own way, so as I said, this is the inspiration behind this build, so make sure to show so so much love and support to this amazing creator, and without any further talking, let's just start with the build, I hope you will enjoy and get so so much inspiration.
the final result and let me tell you I'm very happy with the way this hotel turned out. So what we are going to do is just have a little tour around this hotel area. And also I really love using this item right here which is kind of recreating a fountain but without using the actual fountain items because I like using different items from time to time. And after a while I get tired of these other fountains, so I actually kind of created my own fountain using these two bathtub items and I really like the result and also the usage of this red hotel logo that I made, so yeah I'm very happy with this little plaza area in front of the hotel. But I do take adding a few benches right here into consideration, but I absolutely forgot to order them to be honest, so I might add them at a later point. And I will also try to make a transparent version of this logo, like the Red Residences Hotel logo, and use it for the benches because I feel like this would be a very cool effect. And I think I will just add one bench right here so it doesn't like fully cover this stone structure that is going on right here so I think one bench would be perfectly fine and I will also fill in this area because it looks kind of awkward right now but for the main build I just wanted to show you this hotel and like the little rooftop that I made with the pool and seating area so this is what the hotel looks like from down here um, as seen from this angle, it's like the most flattering in my opinion because the logo of the Red Residences Hotel is like perfectly seen and the problem is like the more you approach it kind of duplicates the red logo which is a bummer to be honest but I couldn't find any item which would fix this like any item that would cover the second red logo which you can see or the kind of spot down below but I think it's still fine and I'm still convinced that it doesn't interrupt the flow too much but as a perfectionist I would have loved to find a workaround but as I said as seen from this angle I think it's like absolutely perfect but the closer you get the more weird this logo might look like because it's duplicated but I think it's still fine so as I said I might add a few items right here. I also had this little area which was like very tough to fill in or like come up with any spectacular build idea. So I just made this little space filler which is like a little seating area and I think it absolutely makes sense like in front of a hotel you just arrived and before you enter and check in you just want to have a cup of coffee or something and just relax and stuff or just even if you're in the hotel already, like with your room and stuff and you just want to sit outside. I think it's a perfect addition, so I added this little build or space filler basically. So, and I also spontaneously came up with a little rooftop idea, so you have this staircase which leads you to this roof. And it's kind of a roof balcony, like with this little pool area and also of course some little essentials like this little pool or water bowl. So what I tried with this area is to perfectly capture this hotel atmosphere. And I'm also planning on doing a very very interesting lookout right here, like I already have an idea of what I'm going to do with this area and let me tell you, my vision is very very cool, like I don't want to give away too much because it's going to be a surprise and a new design made by myself, but I can assure you that it's going to be absolutely amazing, I mean hopefully, I hope the build will turn out as I envision it, but I'm very excited to create the design that I'm planning on doing for this area, so stay tuned for that. Um, it's definitely not going to stay like this, like obviously. Um, so instead of a endless void of sand, you will actually get a very cool build right here, so stay tuned for my upcoming videos. If you don't want to miss it, feel free to subscribe, it would make me very happy and just inspires me to keep going and keep sharing all those builds that I'm creating. 
So this is like the little rooftop area as I mentioned. It's pretty simple because you can still move around like it's not cluttered or something. But I think it's the perfect amount of space like as I said you can freely move around like without any issues at all. And this area is pretty empty as for now but I'm planning on transitioning this like into a last little shopping district until we finally get to the desert aspect of this island but stay tuned for that i actually have so many more shop ideas for like npc builds and stuff so i'm definitely going to upload and share all of these and yeah so this is today's video basically um i hope you enjoyed and received some inspiration if you need any help or need any custom designs used for this build I will make sure to put them in the video's description and also I just uploaded this hotel design that I made so if you would like to use it I will display it right here so this is the creator code of Redshift which contains all of the designs that I made for this island except for my McNico's design which is based on McDonald's but if you're interested in using this I will display it right here and I also uploaded a video on how to build your very own McNico's and I even showcased two different build versions so if you're looking for inspiration you can definitely watch this video if you would like to it's also on my channel so yeah Thank you so much for tuning in, have a wonderful day, stay safe, God bless you and bye!